The co-founder of the Sarasota Music Festival, conductor and violinist, dies at age 90. SNN's Crystal Knowles speaks with people who knew Paul Wolf and the legacy he now leaves behind. Paul was a man with a vision. Roseanne McCabe remembers the first day she met conductor Paul Wolf, almost 26 years ago. He was such an accomplished musician. Performing his first recital at 12, then beginning his conducting career at only 15 for a WNYC radio orchestra, he was destined to be a musician, playing piano and other instruments. Most people don't know, they think of him as a violinist and as a conductor, but he was also an oboe player. Wolf co-founded what is today the Sarasota Music Festival almost 51 years ago. But he always strove for more. He also conducted the youth orchestra program. Paul Wolf had such a presence in Sarasota long before even I joined the youth orchestra. Lauren Hirsch was one of his students. To be a high school student and have the same person conduct your ensemble. It was his kindness, Hirsch says, that set him apart from other conductors. He treated us the way he treated the main orchestra. Wolf treated every musician with the same esteem. It's so musical. I mean, that. Even though we were, you know, little high school kids who obviously, I'm sure, as, as much as we wanted to sound like the main orchestra, we weren't there yet. But he was going to lead us and teach us in the same way. They say he wore his heart on his sleeve. A kindness about him that he also applied to everything. They will never forget his smile. In Sarasota, Crystal Knowles. And he loved to laugh. SNN Suncoast News Network. Even though he retired many years ago, he would always come to the Sarasota Music Festival. This year they celebrated his 90th birthday. 